Hey guys, welcome back to another Alliance War season 39. This is the second war. And we are facing this time uh, Jedi Assassins against Sueda's Alliance. This is an alliance that was created like four seasons ago and they have ended at Masters for a couple seasons now. So anyway, we had to do again this time Pad 9, but with a different team. Okay. Uh, we brought Colossus. Colossus is a champion that benefits from global attack. And he's really good. Like one of the best champions that benefits from this global is Colossus. And I'm really thinking on starting to ban him for the next wars because he's kind of broken. You'll, you'll see on this video. Anyway, we had to face this Arcus on the first note. Uh, as you can see, we, we were getting constantly a uh, detox charge. So I wasn't getting any deb debuff uh, on me. So it was really easy. Like once I got my SP2, uh, that crit damage I got uh, was insane. Uh, if you want uh, to Colossus deal that much of damage you need omega red uh, synergy the because for every armor up uh, colossus gets uh, he's gonna be getting increasing his damage by two percent per armor up so um i i want i wanted to to get emma frost synergy as well because it gives me more power gain uh, depending on the armor up i have uh, but but I couldn't. I had to switch my team, so I brought Nimrod as a third champion because I had two important no three important fights against three mutants uh, on this war, and it was way safer to use Nimrod instead Colossus. So yeah, against this Mister Negative, uh, it was uh, kind of sketchy, in, I'd say because. Uh, I forgot I had mutant boost on, so when I used my SP2, I got the indestructible buff as you as you saw, and it got like uh, a few seconds more. It took a, a few seconds more, but I managed uh, to solo the fight. Uh, the next fight was against Null. This champion is a really scary champion, and a lot of people have some problems fighting against him, and I also had. Like, uh, on this fight, I didn't play well because when I was getting my detox church, I was actually taking off one by one the debuff I was getting uh, at the start of the fight. So that was the wrong way to play. And then I real realized when I was uh, basically cornered, uh, then I got the Abyss church off. And yeah, I threw my SP2, uh, hope, hoping that it creates, but it didn't. And uh, right now, it really got uh, really scary. Like, look at that. He has eight prowess. I was blocking specials. I was getting debuff on me. I was like, oh no, please end this. End this. <laughs> so I got my detox uh, immunity. I used my SP2 and every single hit of that special two did a crit i was like oh my god i'm saved <laughs> so i got my sp3 back after that sp2 then i landed my sp3 and oh it was over I, I i almost died there like not gonna lie it was kind of sketchy because i made it sketchy you know uh, Colossus is a really good option and, uh, to fight against Null, but I didn't fight the, the proper way. Anyway, we had to face uh, Apocalypse on the next fight, no 25. Uh, it's a mini boss. Um, I used SP1 start boost to make it uh, faster, but I made a mistake again, guys. Like yesterday, to be honest, I, it wasn't my day. Anyway, as you as you saw, I evaded so. Uh, the note, the local note he has is when you evade, he gets a uh, power gain. It's like Masochins, but it gets a uh, Masochins, uh, but he gets a uh, power instead. Region, you know. Uh, anyway, uh, that SP2 didn't do that much of damage uh, to me because I had a 25% resistant SP3 boost, and also it wasn't. A big problem, to be honest. Like uh, once I did my SP2, uh, Apocalypse was there. That's why Nimrod is one of the best champions 
tech champions that can be can beat uh, basically any mutant on the entire map. And on this next fight, I, I had to fight uh, uh, Kitty Pride. So Nimrod as well, he's one of the best options because he gets uh, rid of those prowess debuff. So once I got my intercept here, I got the fury, increased, the, increased my damage. And yeah, I used my SP2 as well and he, <laughs> she was dead. Uh, and on the, se on the second fight of this path fight on section two, I had to take down this Nick Fury with Colossus, okay? So, it was an, a funny, fun fight. I really enjoyed uh, to take down this Nick Fury here. Uh, so basically, Nick Fury, you have to kill him twice. And yeah, I got the intercept, then I was just waiting for him to throw my SP2, but I got clipped there. <laughs> Mistakes were made. And yeah, look at that SP2 I did with Colossus, man. Like, instantly I got my SP3. He's just insane. Then I got another intercept. I got the extra damage from the Fury from the local node. And then SP3 didn't kill him on the his first life, but I was really okay. Like, since Colossus, as, as like I said, uh, benefits from the global attack offensive, uh, he's gonna be really good, one of the best options against uh, any champion that um, benefits from global defensive on steady ground. So yeah, I was, I had uh, class advantage here, so I had the fight under control for the entire uh, of the fight, and I was just trying to get another fury, but I didn't, I guess I didn't, and I threw my SP2 and that 75 crit damage ended that nick fury and these guys uh you probably watch my videos in spanish as well well as you as you saw there um i died twice uh, with the scorpion he's not a really good option for long shot there but i messed up uh, the assignments so uh, yeah lesson learned right so i had to finish this fight i decided to go with omega red which this isn't a good matchup either so i was just panicking like i really played it, it wrong uh, i got the intercept as well but yeah i was like okay spores is gonna have to kill this long shot yes or yes then i used my sp2 hoping to kill him and he did <laughs> so yeah uh, that was a really nightmare fight for me on my main main account but anyway let's go for the next fight on this next fight i'm gonna increase the speed uh, because it is kind of uh, a long fight so let me explain what happened here uh, if as you can see i'm getting crit damage from domino for the entire fight which it shouldn't happen but i made a mistake that i didn't know and my alliance mates told me that i was getting crit damage because i had resonate mastery on so when you try to attack domino since the ability doesn't trigger uh, the weakness debuff doesn't apply you're gonna be getting crit damage every single time you hit domino so if you want to use nimrod against domino don't use that mastery that was my mistake uh, i almost died uh, well not not almost but i lost like uh, 70 to 80 percent of hp on the entire fight and i really played like uh, a, a kid, uh, a gear, uh, like a girl, you know? I, I, I played that fight really scared because I didn't wanna die. I uh, I had died twice on my main account. So yeah, and on the last fight guys, to the boss. Mm, it was painful, not gonna lie. So uh, Colossus is a great option to fight Terrax, uh, but uh, I think uh, the issue here was that my Colossus is only rank 3, okay? He's not rank 4, so obviously my damage is not gonna be that much. And I was I was having really bad RNG because my crits weren't, weren't doing... Well, my specials weren't critting that much. Uh, just the first special 2 I did, 
did a crit. You're gonna you're gonna see uh, on on this fight that when I'm using my SP2, it isn't critting. Like look at that. None of those four hits from my special two were a crit. Not a single one. I was like, no way, man. Uh, and I was really worried because every single time uh, Terrax uses a special, he's gonna get his rock field, you know. And when he has rock field, um, since I'm immune to armor break, uh, it doesn't mean I'm not gonna get damage from Terrax, okay, from his rock field ability. I'm gonna get. Uh, damage uh, as soon as I get uh, close to him so what I have to do is to stay uh, out of his range that way I can make him lose his power lose his rock field charge but sometimes I had to attack him so I can make some space between us and yeah it ended up uh, taking some damage uh, because of his ability and look at that I, I, I haven't got hit by any single thing like he hasn't got uh, uh, hit, hit hit me but i already lost <laughs> almost all my hp and that's why like i said uh, none of my sp2 were crit like no not a single hit and also my colossus is only rank three anyway this special two i was like please crit and it did Oh my god. <laughs> I ended that fight. I solo it. Uh, it was a solo. It was a great solo. I didn't die on this account, but it was really close, man. Like, really, really close. Uh, we ended up uh, dying six times this war. It was a worst, the worst war we have done for a couple months. Um, myself, I died twice. Like, you don't see that every day. Um, yeah, uh, anyway, we ended up beating Sueda's Alliance. They started really bad at the at the start. Uh, but yeah, anyway, I have a couple a couple guys I know from there and that they are cool. So yeah, I hope you guys understood uh, anything from this video. And if you enjoyed and, and want to continue to watch these kind of videos, please hit the, the, the like button. Subscribe if you haven't and we'll see you on the next one guys Bye. Bye